What is up guys, Groovy Guitar Dude here with a quick guitar lesson for a bank account by 21 Savage. Guys, the very first thing that you need to know for bank account is that you need a capo on fourth fret. All right guys, this is another song where we're not really gonna have specific chords. We're just gonna have what's kind of like chord shapes a little bit, and we're gonna pick a bass note and we're gonna have a little picking part below that. So the first one we're gonna start with is kind of an A minor shape. So what we're gonna start with is a pointer finger on first fret of the B, and then we're gonna hit the open an A and the first fret on the B at the same time. That's gonna be our first note. And then what we're gonna do after that is we're gonna go high E, and then we're gonna go third fret on B, and then we're gonna go back to high E, and that's it for that shape. So all of our shapes for this, we're gonna have um, kind of four different shapes for this. That's gonna be our first one. They're all gonna be kind of based around that. We're gonna have different bass notes for each one, but they're all gonna be that same thing. It's all gonna be a bass note and then It'll go kind of like bass note, and then open high E, third on B, open high E. Um, just about like that. So that's our first one, one more time. Open A, first fret on B, high E open, third fret B, high E open. So next one's gonna be the same thing, but it's gonna be third fret on G, and first fret on B. So same exact thing, the only thing we're changing is our low note here. So that's gonna be third fret on, high, uh, on the low E, and then uh, first fret on B. Same thing, open high E, third fret B, open high E. And then our last one, our last kind of shape, we're gonna have one more kind of after this, but it's within this shape too. Same thing, all we're gonna do is change the low note, and what that's gonna be is gonna be a, a first fret on um, low E, or that would be an F note. So you can do that two ways. The way I like to do it is I like to throw my thumb up there and hit that. But if you can't do that, you can, you know, switch it out whatever combination you need to to get there. But I like to do it with my thumb. So same thing, uh, first fret on low E and B, and then open high E, and then third B, open high E. And our very last shape, guys, is going to be a Still the same thing, low E, first fret, so that's another, like I said, like F note. And we're gonna have first fret on the high E. Let that hang out. And then we're gonna do just open high E. And then that is it, guys. We repeat those four-ish kind of shapes through the whole entire song. So I'm gonna walk through it really slow on this side, and then I'm gonna show you again on this side so you guys can see what I'm doing as far as the picking goes a little bit more clearly. So very slowly on this side, it'll look about like this. Same thing over on this side. And guys, lastly, a little bit of both sides, a little bit further back. Hopefully you can see everything really well. This will be a little bit closer to full speed. And guys, that is all that you need to know to play Bank Account. This song is fun and easy to play, and it's very cool. I've been listening to it a lot for the last couple of days. As always, if you guys have any questions, you can hit me up in the comments below. I'm usually pretty quick getting back to those, and if this video helped you out, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. I have about 330 other guitar and ukulele lessons on this channel, and I usually try to post about three to five new lessons every single week. So if you're learning guitar or ukulele, this is the perfect channel for you to check out. Guys, I hope you have a lot of fun playing Bank Account, and I'll see y'all soon.